With the U.S. accounting for more infections from monkeypox virus than any other country in the world, researchers are now studying a proposed new protocol. As CBS 2's Dave Carlin reports, it would split vaccine doses with the intention of getting sh more shots into more people. The monkeypox virus, newly declared a federal public health emergency, needs a diligent yet calm approach, said White House COVID response coordinator Dr. Ashish Jha. Thankfully, no one has died, so we are still at a point in this in this outbreak uh, where I, I do believe that while it is very, very serious, it is not something uh, that is reason for widespread alarm. Mayor Eric Adams says it's time to invoke the Defense Production Act, speeding up vaccine delivery because, quote, we continue to be the epicenter of this outbreak with over 25 percent of cases nationally. The United States government has bungled this response. New York City Council member Eric Botcher criticizes the slow rollout of vaccine doses with the latest allotment of 22,000 going so fast all the new appointments were booked within minutes of going online Thursday night. A different way of administering the shots could stretch the vaccine supply. The FDA is studying whether it works to split a single dose into five by giving patients shallower injections into the skin, spreading out a dose instead of using it all at once. The cases worldwide are at least 26,864 and nationwide at least 7,100. And in New York State, at least 1,748 and New Jersey, at least 214. There's no reason it can't spread to other communities via sexual or other close contact. We're just starting to see a small number of secondary infections in women and children. If it starts spreading, you know, with kids, that's very alarming. Some say a better response is needed before case numbers grow and the virus becomes established in a variety of communities. A college campus this fall, for example. They say the time for greater vaccine supply and more testing and data collection is now. Dave Carlin, CBS2 News. The city's Department of Corrections says that there is a confirmed case of monkeypox among their staff. This individual is a uniformed employee but does not work at a DOC facility and is currently isolating. For more information on monkeypox, including identifying symptoms and tips on how to prevent an infection, head to our website, cbsnewyork.com.